ImmuPatch is a microneedle based technology and microneedles are very short uh, micron sized needles that you can have multiple micro, micro needles on a patch and using that you create a, a very very small bar, uh, pore in the skin that then allows the drug or the vaccine to go through the skin um, and therefore you get it into the system without having to use uh, needles and syringes and things like that. We really want to get away from having to use needle and syringes both from a cost point of view and from the stability of the vaccine. Um, we want to get the vaccine onto the microneedle or even into the microneedle, make the microneedle totally from the vaccine itself. And this then will get away from having to use a, a vial on one hand and a needle and syringe and train somebody how to fill the syringe properly and inject it into the person. Instead you'll be able to take this microneedle patch and just put it on your skin. The three main advantages of our technology, um, firstly the, the microneedle patches which are produced by the Tyndall National Institute are ultra sharp so you don't need a lot of force to, to push it into the skin. The second advantage is um, it's, it's dose sparing so if a vaccine manufacturer or drug manufacturer makes a, a large batch they only need a tenth of the dose they currently give to an individual to get the same response. So the vaccines will go a lot further around the population, but you'll still get the same uh, immune responses. Logistically, delivering uh, a microneedle patch compared to delivering uh, vials of, of different materials is a lot lower. There's about 60% of the cost of actually vaccinating an individual is involved in actually getting that vaccine to the site and then also get rid of that waste afterwards. And then finally, the last uh, advantage is that it's pain free compared to a needle and syringe or compared to other microneedles that are being made that go deeper into the skin. Our microneedles just go into the surface and you don't feel that they're, they're too short to go down to the pain receptor so you don't feel any, any pain from it. So we're hoping that people will be a lot more kind of, you know, less afraid of going to, to, to get a vaccine or a drug delivered to them.